Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Gemini. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other placements. Your messages could be there. So, Gemini, this could be your energy. It could be the other person's energy. But somebody is afraid to speak up about how they really feel. And um, <clears throat> there's a message here that they need to do this. They need to do this before it's too late because uh, if they don't, they're going to regret later. So this is a warning in advance for this person uh, to speak up to their partner, to this other person or this potential partner, how they feel. Okay? Let your intentions be known. Let your feelings be known. You have the minstrel. Okay? So this is either you or it is somebody else who really needs to tell you how they feel. They're afraid to. They're afraid of what they might receive. In other words, they're probably afraid of rejection. Um, this could be... Uh, these fears have a, a really strong hold on this person, a power over this person. Um, I feel like they want to really want to tell you how they feel. They just are too afraid. Um, um, this could very well be a pattern in their life uh, because they've been hurt before, okay, with the devil. It could be because they're imagining the worst possible thing that could happen to them if they did tell you their feelings. Obviously, that's coming from someplace really deep, you know. There's definitely, oh yeah, this card's sitting here. There's definitely a deeper emotional issue that is hidden, that is behind the choices that they are making, okay. That's what this is. You know, it's the Nine of Cups. Yes, it is the wish card. But the reason maybe they're not getting their wish is because there's a cup missing. And it is hidden behind the curtain. And it is responsible. You see how he's choosing what he's going to eat from that plate? It's behind. Uh, it's what's responsible for uh, this person, uh, for the choices they've been making. One minute. I will be right back. Sorry about that. I had to pick up my little my little girl, my little dog here. She's on my lap. Okay, so, um, and you know what? Um, I mean, this could be you really afraid of, of telling somebody how you feel about them. Um, or this could be, you might have a secret admirer. That's what this card says. This card can speak to secret admirers. I mean, you, you may be... Uh, admiring somebody or in love with somebody but not telling them but I mean it, it goes the other way too so you could very much have a secret admirer yeah and they're too afraid to step out of the dark because they're afraid you're going to reject them one minute yeah so they're afraid you're going to reject them if this is them you know it's one way or the other um yeah so you're not a couple you're not a couple and but somebody does want to have an opportunity with you or you want to have an opportunity with them but uh you're too afraid to tell them or they're too afraid to tell you because this is a card of a uh falling in love uh, and it i see it over here again uh romance it's possible that um, there could be regret. Yes, okay, 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 I see what's going on here. Okay, so, yeah, all right. So they're afraid to tell you how they, how they feel. They're imagining the worst, them or you, whoever this is. And so what they're imagining is, and, and I mean, it's real bad, <laughs> They're, they're seeing gray. They're seeing being the, the, that you're going to turn them down. And this, this could even be being turned down again. So this could be somebody actually that you do know, but that is hiding their feelings uh, from you. 
and is wanting another opportunity with you. So either this is somebody you have dated in the past or been with in the past, or uh, this is somebody who's just, uh, or this is a new relationship and they're afraid to tell you how they feel, okay? Uh, or, um, yeah, a new person, I mean, and they're afraid to tell you how they how they feel. Um, I mean, you may know them, they may be in your social circle, but, uh, but you're not, you know, that close to them. Not yet. And so, this person is in the dark about being able to manifest it. They are probably lacking confidence, but it is what they're thinking about. Okay? They're... Uh, it's like all they can think about. We've got the air card here, uh, the the Gryphon here. Um, this could be somebody who's really afraid to take the risk, okay? It feels really risky to them. But uh, I feel like their luck is going to change. Like maybe they're feeling down on their luck, uh, but their luck will change or it could change simply by just taking that next step, <laughs> you know. Um, it could be that an opportunity will be given to this person or th that everything is set, you know, in the right time, in the right place for it to happen. Because definitely somehow, some way, this person's luck is changing or is going to change. It can be they're see here they're in the dark, but we have the owls over here, and the owls lend their eyes to be able to see through the dark. Yeah. Uh, looking deeper with the owls, um, paying attention, uh, being more observant. So we have this uh, Knight of Shields over here, um, and this is this is this person. I think I mean it could be you, could be them, but uh, they want to come and tell that beautiful lady up there in the balcony how they feel. Okay, it's just that it's just that they see this is a mystery. They have to solve this mystery. How do I do this? And, and so, Ace of Wands. So they have got some really intense feelings uh, around this. Uh, definitely, they're feeling very passionate uh, about this person. They are very, very attracted to this person. And then we have that card. So this is like a... Okay, so it's it it is the uh, the coffin, but what it indicates is something ending. It indi indicates change. Um, it indicates that whatever is changing, it it can feel uncomfortable. Okay, so and this is like they want to solve this mystery. They want to step out and tell this person how how they feel, but. It like it feels uncomfortable because they're they don't really know what to expect. But uh, based on their experience, they would think it would be uh, the worst, you know. So they're. I feel like maybe they've been rejected before, and and maybe that left a scar on them. Somehow they've been. That's what it is. They've been rejected before, and it's left its mark on on their psyche, you know. And um, is is been sitting there in the subconscious mind. I feel, and is is maybe the hidden emotional issue of what is behind uh, their choices or not choosing, which is still a choice. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So they're conflicted. Um, 
I feel like they're uh, maybe getting uh, frustrated a little um, because they really want to do this. And so they're, you know, um, they're having to deal with their inner demons. And so this is about a decision. Yeah, it definitely, this definitely could be somebody in your uh, social uh, circle here. Somebody you know, um, maybe you don't know all that well, but you know, uh, maybe it's a friend who's, who's uh, in love with you and not telling or maybe you're in love with a friend and not telling. The thing is, I think you'd be surprised to learn that they feel the same way too. And if you don't tell them how you feel, you may miss out on this opportunity. Or on, you know, this this. This could be something really great, a great love. I feel like something really, really beautiful can come out of this. But it requires an action, and that action is to speak up. Because if you don't speak up, it's going to be too late, and the opportunity will have passed because of something else that could happen or may happen. Um, but that is the message. The message is speak up, um, stop procrastinating, speak up uh, before it's too late. So uh, those are very heavy words that I don't like to use before it's too late. You know, I find them very threatening, you know, um, very ominous words. But this is what this is what's in the cards. It's like, speak up or you're going to lose uh, an opportunity with someone, you or them. I mean, this could be them. Um, and they need to speak up so they don't lose this opportunity with you. This is a love that is just totally going to hit you. Bang! It's, it's like... Uh, it's like I don't even know how to explain it okay but I'm telling you it's something special so this luck I feel requires action or this change in luck will require action get cracking is basically what this is saying. That is what I have for you. I thank you for watching, for liking, for sharing my videos, and for subscribing. Also, um, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.